It's the first site that welcomes visitors to the historic core of Malacca, a replica of a treasure ship of Admiral Zheng He or Cheng Ho. You'll also find statues of the Admiral here, as well as cafes, hotels and other businesses capitalizing on the mystique of the great Chinese explorer and diplomat. Enthusiasts for Zheng He don't come any more keen than Tan Ta Sen, founder of Malacca's Cheng Ho Cultural Museum and president of the International Zheng He Society. Well, the society, uh, we set up just to collect uh, all the Zheng Ho enthusiasts who are interested to study Zheng Ho's his history, his contribution, his legacy. And we have this as a practical project to bring uh, all the uh, artifacts or relics of Cheng Ho to show to the people. Tan believes Ming Dynasty artifacts found in this well are evidence that the building housing the museum was once part of Zheng He's warehouse complex here. Admiral Cheng He first came to Malacca in 1405. Chinese records say that his fleet comprised around 260 ships and nearly 28,000 men. He's believed to have visited Malacca at least another four times during his life. Now, this is a replica of Cheng Ho's navigation map. Here, he marked the word Malacca in Chinese. He was able to offer peace and stability to the whole region, especially offering protection from the Siamese uh, invaders and also pirates in the streets of Malacca. He was able to subdue the pirates and gave Malacca a century of peace and stability. That helped transform Malacca into a major international port. Uh, peace, diplomatic and trade relations with foreign rulers. Those who've studied the Admiral believe Zheng He was much more than an explorer, but also a powerful force for international diplomacy, trade and collaboration. Ryan Meltzer, CCTV, Malacca, Malaysia.